Hey guys, so for today's video, I'm gonna be trying out all these dresses that I have back here for you and hopefully give you some outfit inspo and if you're into like feminine, modesty style outfits. So let's get right into the video. All right, you guys, so if this is the first time you're here, welcome, my name is Jessica. And on this channel, I've been sharing my faith as a new Christian. Am I still considered new? Um, I've been devoted to Christ since November of 2020 when the world went crazy. So anyways, you guys, I have a lot of different content up on this channel, but I did want to sort of jump into something a little bit different. I have shared one other kind of modesty style outfit uh, video ideas. <laughs> did I say that right? Outfit video. Um, and so I've been kind of collecting dresses lately because I feel like I've been sort of changing. And um, I don't know if it's me feeling a little bit convicted because of how I used to dress. Although I don't think I ever dressed too crazy before. I think my style was sort of like sporty, um, a little bit edgy. I did used to work out a lot, so I used to wear a lot of like form-fitting clothing. And you know, I never really used to care about how much leg I would show or anything like that. But now, um, I feel like I've been sort of changing as a person. And I don't know if it has to do anything with me becoming Christian or me just, you know, maturing into the woman that I am. I'm 33 years old now, I had to think about that, but I'm 33 years old, I'm a mom of two, and so, you know, I, I wanna age gracefully, I don't wanna, I guess, I guess it's normal for people to change, right? Anyway, um, that's not the whole point of this video, but I did kinda wanna address that. And also the fact that my husband likes when I wear dresses. So I'm also sort of catering to him, I guess, in that sense. And um, so there's a lot of reasons for me trying to dress a little bit more feminine, a little bit more modest. And with that being said, hopefully this video kind of inspires you to find affordable dresses. <laughs> So hopefully this video sort of inspires you, gives you some outfit ideas. Um, all of these are very affordable, you guys. So all of these are from affordable shops. Um, I've gotten some on Shein, um, Walmart, Marshalls, and I think that was it. Um, Old Navy and Old Navy. I'm wearing the Old Navy dress, which you guys have seen in that first video that I mentioned earlier where I was talking about modesty. Uh, okay, so the first dress I'm gonna share with you guys is the one that I'm wearing today It's the striped one and I have shared this one before um, This is a very comfortable very flowy Dress it fits me right over my knee, which is good length for me if I can't squat down Without exposing myself that is way too short for me. Um, I have a toddler who's running around so I need to be able to go and run after him and grab him without feeling uncomfortable um but yeah you guys this dress i can't remember how much it was i hope you guys don't mind me i don't remember how much any of these dresses were except that none of them were over 30 dollars and i do also have um a few pairs of sandals and some easy slip-on tennis shoes that um you guys will see me trying on with these dresses these are my go-to shoes right now i need comfort i don't do heels you guys i need to be comfortable and I'm also very tall as it is already I'm 5'7 so I don't need height um so so yeah as you guys saw I have like um some tan sandals these are from Target uh these are by Universal Thread and these are super comfortable you guys I live in these these are like my go-to out of these three sandals that I chose the tan ones are by far the ones that are the most comfortable and the ones that I reach for often you can probably see my footprint in here because this is how much I actually wear them and so I thought it'd be nice to have like you know a tan pair a lighter pair these are from Shein um, these are not actually that comfortable I thought they would be because you know they seem like they're very light but they're kind of a little bit um, stiff they're very stiff maybe I just need a break into these um, but yeah I also have a black pair which um, are also super comfy these are uh, from Old Navy and um, I needed like 
you know, a black pair. Yeah, my um, sneakers were from Walmart and these are super easy to slip on and slip out of. Usually I do go for comfort. Again, I'm already tall. I don't really ever wear heels unless it's like a very formal event. And so even then, sometimes you'll find me in like flats. Okay, you guys, let's get into this pile of clothes back here. The first thing I wanted to mention was this slip, you guys. I have been on the hunt for a good slip, and I think this is a pretty good affordable option. I got this one off of Amazon, and it's sort of like a very nudie pink color. Um, it is, let's see, I don't know if you guys will be able to tell, but it fits me sort of where this dress fits me which is right over my knee and this is exactly what i was looking for because i did go into target to try to find a slip but they were all kind of short and i wanted something that could hide under my dress that didn't feel like i was wearing something under my dress because if it's shorter then i would be able to feel that it's shorter i don't know if i explained that well enough but i hope you guys get what i mean this is very soft material it's not like a silk or a satin i don't know if you guys will be able to tell and i honestly don't know what this material is called i wish i knew but i will find out and i'll put it up on the screen so um the only thing that i didn't love was that i didn't realize it's sort of like a v-neck i wanted this to be just a little bit lower and kind of straight across so that i can um wear it under different types of dresses that could hide that you know because sometimes i don't want to show that i'm wearing a slip so i did wear this under two of the dresses that i have back here and i'll let you know which ones um but it's a pretty good option and they did have many other colors so i'll go ahead and link it down below in case you guys want to check it out um, i will be using my amazon link and just letting you guys know i do get a little credit if you guys use my link um just for full transparency but let's go into the dresses um this dress i got on shein and um it's a pretty good dress um the only thing i don't really like about this dress is that it's sort of a material that is very easy to wrinkle and um what material is this i need to find out i need to find out i need to get educated on materials because um i don't know if I can find it on this tag, it doesn't have any other tag except the Shein tag. So yeah, that's kind of a downer. It does wrinkle really easily. And I did try um, ironing it for this video. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I didn't do such a good job. Um, but other than that, it's such a pretty color. I love this color. It's sort of like a darker mustard color and the print is really pretty. Um, I do wish that this elastic was just a little bit lower um, or maybe I just have a really long torso um, but I feel like I'm not even big up here and I feel like it was kind of going up into the breast area and it was I kind of felt like I, every time I wear this I feel like I have to pull it down and then if I pull it down this kind of exposes me a little bit so usually I do wear my slip when I wear this one but yeah so that's the only downfall for this dress but it is such a pretty dress and I love the length of it too it's so pretty and so feminine and yeah it's a good affordable option so this dress you guys is from time and true and it's such a pretty dress i don't know if the camera is picking up the actual color it's sort of like a reddish orangey color i love the little frilly sleeves and the length of this again is so pretty um and this little detail on the side it doesn't really do anything like it doesn't make it any <laughs> any like tighter um it's just basically for decoration there um but yeah i also do like that it doesn't really even though it has this detail in the front it doesn't really land too low on me at least i don't know if that's you know depending on your height or your size but um yeah it's really pretty and really comfortable 
and this one i got at walmart the time and true brand from walmart is actually really good i just realized the shoes are actually from time and true as well and yeah i can totally wear this with like some little sneakers like this or with like some sandals i think i tried both on in the video for you guys but that's that one okay so now this one i am a thrifter i love salvation army and like goodwill and this I can't remember where I picked up this dress, but you guys, I know it's a little funky color, but I think it's so cute. I love the little polka dots and that it has pockets. And this is such a good material. It's not see-through at all. Um, I think this is more of like a, I think this style is a little bit more different. It's more girly, more, um, I don't know, like more preppy. I don't know if I'm describing it correctly, but um, I, every time I wear this dress, I feel like, what's her name? Um, I'm going to put a picture of her here. I think this is like such a pretty retro girly type of dress and I love it. And um, yeah, I got it at a really good price because I thrifted it. So this one was probably under $10 easily and totally worth it. Okay, so the next dress that I have, this is probably like the most pretty dress I own at least I think so I love this dress and I got this one off of Marshall's and it has its own little slip on the inside it is a little bit shorter than I wish again because every time I have this dress on I could feel it I wish it was the length of the dress and doesn't make sense for it to be that short um, because this little front part kind of goes all the way over it I've seen dresses that are kind of um, that kind of have the slip that is a little bit shorter but the whole point is for you to show off your leg <laughs> if that makes sense so this one gets covered up and I don't get why the slip is shorter but um, I love the little detail in the front the little two brown buttons and the little bow on the side and the sleeves I absolutely love these little like sleeves they look so feminine and so pretty it has a little teardrop thing in the back I feel super feminine when I wear this dress and I haven't worn it enough um, but I'm also waiting for an occasion to wear this dress the only thing I will say is that it does have this button which is one of the reasons why I got this um, dress because it already came with a button there but I feel like it doesn't do much it's kind of loose in there I don't know if it makes any sense um, I tried showing you guys in the video that I feel like I still need to wear something underneath because there's way too much room in there. I don't know if it makes sense or maybe if I had a bigger bust it wouldn't be doing that. I just think it's like a malfunction. They probably needed to put the button a little bit lower. I, I don't know. Anyway, um, okay you guys, so the last dress is another Marshalls find and it's such a pretty dress okay I know it looks a little funky hanging on the hanger <laughs> but when I have this on I feel so feminine so pretty like it's such a flowy beautiful dress I love the length of the sleeve and the little fringe at the end they're so it's so pretty um also it came with its very own slip you guys and it's the length of the dress which is a plus um i wore this for a photo shoot and i felt so pretty in it um i've only worn it for the photo shoot but i feel like this is a statement piece like i can't overdo it i can't overwear it and yeah so which is the reason why i wore it for the picture and i can always display that picture um yeah but it's such a pretty dress and it's it's a heavier material um but yeah i'll probably wear it again for like the fall or for winter um but yeah you guys it took me so long to film this video and it's really because i wanted to show you guys how they fit and stuff like that and um, just show you that you guys can really find good options at affordable prices i don't know if i found my style yet and yeah i feel like you know i'm still kind of going through this change and trying to find my my way <laughs> 
um it, it seems like such a silly thing to say but it really does you know kind of bring about some sort of energy when you change when, when you dress differently i would say but yeah you guys uh let me know which was your favorite dress again i think it was for me like this pink one was my favorite one and it's probably this one but i don't think i would wear this one as much as i would wear this one or maybe i'm just saying that because right now it feels hot and i see myself reaching for this one more um out of all of them i think though the one that i'm wearing right now is the most comfortable like just the material and um the fact that it's like a short sleeve so i don't feel like i'm restricted with my arms not not that these are tight or anything but you know you know what i mean like i feel like when i have something over my my arm or, or like especially because all of these sort of had like an elastic at the end i kind of feel like you know i feel it there so yeah um as you guys can tell i don't really make videos about clothing i'm having a hard time explaining myself but that is it for this video let me know in the comments down below which was your favorite dress and if you guys want to see more videos like this just simply like that first comment let me know give me a thumbs up and yeah i'll make more of these for you i have been i have been eyeing things on shein and i have been um kind of interested in skirts and I just need to figure out how to style skirts because there's more work with skirts you have to find a top that goes with it and so I would like to make more videos like this for you if you guys are interested but anyways you guys that is it for real this time let me know if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to smash that like button stay blessed and I'll see you guys on the next one bye